Hello guys and welcome back. As you can see it's Terraria, Mark here. And I've had pretty much my first request, so I will be fulfilling that. It is to show you guys how to make a multiplayer server. As you can see in my multiplayer let's play, I did make a server and so I know how to do it. First you go into multiplayer and you click start server. And you want to choose what world you want to play on. We'll just hop on my free time server. And here, let's say, let's go YouTube. This is my normal password, so I'm sorry, but yep jump on here and it'll do all this stuff and you'll see start a new instance of Terraria to join and you want to take note of this port here because we will be doing something with it later I think the uh, default port is just this number I did not change anything that's just a default port and you can see it's waiting for clients so now at this point you would alt tab out go set up the rest of the stuff and then you could join with a different client you'd restart it in Steam so I actually have to restart the recording to be able to record any of that so I will be right back Hello guys and welcome back. We had just set up the Terraria server in the actual client. So now we will, we are looking at my my oh I just blanked. Router. We are looking at my router settings and as you can see I'm in the applications and gaming settings area and this is my port range forward. As you can see, most anyways, most routers will be like this. And I have this set up to Terraria. Okay, right. Oops. Whoops. Whoops to do. Um <laughs> and then this is the port that it had stated earlier. You want to edit that in there. Type that in. Type that in here again. This is a range. We don't need a range because Terraria only runs on one port. You can see the other stuff I do. So have fun. Have fun, guys. <laughs> and then you type in the IP address of whatever computer you are. The way you can find that out is you can go to. Oh, you see what I use in my free time now. <laughs> Accessories, command prompt. And then you want to type. IP config conf, con, <laughs> config space slash oh I think IP config will just work and you press enter and it will show you a IP address I'm not gonna do that because I don't want to expose my computer to any potential hackers I trust you guys I really do but I'm sorry <laughs> I'm not gonna show my local IP but you would take that IP it would show up right here this is a command prompt you can also do it by typing CMD here and that is CMD right there you can X this out and you type it right in there right there and you fill that in and click enable then you click save settings and then that will port forward from your computer to the router which is your public IP well should be your public IP and you can go into status you can right click this or open new window or you can just click it I guess after you save make sure you save though you don't want to be having to do this again then you just uh, go to status and there will be a IP address right there no not the not anything else just make sure it says IP address and it will not be one of these IP addresses it will be a different one like mine starts off with 69 point something something and so basically that would be the IP address that you use to connect to your Terraria server you take that and type it in into the client that you start up here well, I'll show you that now so I'll be back in a second we're back and as you can see I have started a brand new Terraria leave the other one running you want to start a new one and as you can see the Steam community thing pops up so that proves I did start a new one okay we're gonna jump into multiplayer and you click join I don't know if this is gonna show my IP but okay yeah so you choose your character and then I think it shows your IP yep okay so right here you type in the server IP address blah 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 point blah 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 point blah 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 okay and then you'll click upset accept accept <laughs> You click accept and it'll prompt you for the password that you typed in when you were setting it up. So for me that would be YouTube. And then you're, you'll be playing on the server. And anyone else can do that if you just give them that IP address. I would warn you though that is your public IP address. I would be careful with who you give that to. I would not recommend distributing it if it is on a home network. If that is your home router because that could you leave you pretty exposed. So I would I would not hand that out to the public as I will not be handing that out to the public. But that is how you make a multiplayer server. So if anyone has any questions, please do ask. And goodness, this music is loud. And so I will see you guys next time in my next episode.